What is up, Apex Nation? Not in that screen. Welcome back to Mahakree Universe. Hope you guys are having a great day. I'm having a great day. Ooh, I jumped it. Woohoo! <laughs> so today, we're going to work on this. We're getting that blimp done. And we're going to try to figure out how to connect it. I, I, hi. I have some ideas how to do it. Let's go. So, I think we might use iron bars to connect it. That might be the way we end up connecting it. And we should probably put steps in here today. Will we? I don't know. There's a good chance we will. Um, how am I doing this? I could clean up whatever mess I make. I'm not worried about that. I think I'll just probably get on top of it from here. Yeah, I think that's the best bet. Oh, is it really gonna get cold over here? Uh oh, I probably should have hit. Brought some resistance with me then. Some cold resistance stuff. I went and gathered up a crap ton of. What you Dang it! Uh, snow. That's what this stuff is called. Ball. Get on the sea. Don't don't knock me off now, game. Now, I know we're just going to make it straight right now. We're going to figure it out afterwards. The curve and what have yous. I'm not entirely... Oh, hi. I'm not entirely sure how we're going to do that, but we'll figure it out. But for now... Oh. Do I have my light on? No. Dang. It is bright up here. Uh, Can't see. Found it. Oh, I am super, hey, look, there's more stuff happening down there. And there's a path leading to a thing. Is that a sign? Ooh, might be a sign. Someone's build might finally be happening. Oh, that's a chest. Stop going too far. Oh, I was distracted that time, though. I was looking down there at that thing. It's making progression. And fall. But uh, there was a game I played uh, a year ago, if not more, called One Finger Death Punch on the channel. I played it a while ago. It was a lot of fun. I really liked the game. It's a really cool game. If you haven't checked it out yet, you should definitely go check it out. Even pick it up for yourself, because it's a lot of fun. And next month, One Finger Death Punch 2. Or no, in like three weeks. We'll say that. In like three weeks, One Finger Death Punch 2 releases. But I got the game early. Like, really early. Like, I have it now. And no embargo on it. So I can make all the videos I want on it. <laughs> so I'm really excited for that. That's going to be super fun. And I was looking at screenshots of it today. I was like, oh, that looks really cool. It looks like they up some of the anima anima animations. Those are the word. That's the word. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I can speak English. I'm super excited for that. Can I just in yeah, you know, like just yeah, get a couple of those layers down. So I'm really excited for that. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Can't wait. Now this one, it's a little bit more tricky here. I don't want to do it for. Oh, wait, we got this world to do. Hang on, we'll get to that side. I'm super excited for that. And also, something that just worked out timing wise for me is the last. It should be the last video of Devil May Cry 5 is the day Yoshi's Crafter World releases. That makes it so much easier for me. <laughs> like one series ends, another series. I think I heard my phone, but it's not near me. So good. I don't got to tell it to be quiet. Yeah, it, it's, uh, I can never find my dot here on the white snow. I found it. So that works. One series ends and another series begins. I don't gotta have backlog and have more videos going live than I want going live. That just worked out. That was nice. Also, yesterday, the cat, the girl, she was being real freaky. Real freaky. You ever see those videos? 
where the cat is like perfectly still, won't move an inch no matter what you call to her, you do whatever, she will not move an inch. And then you go around a corner and you come back and she's closer to you. She just doesn't want you to see that she's moving. And you know, it's like she's stalking you to like attack. Well, she was doing that to me last night. I was just sitting in the living room. I looked at her, she's just staring at me, called to her, nope. She wouldn't come to me at all. Usually she'd come right to me and get attention or bring her toy so I could throw it for her and she'd go play fetch. Because she's a dog in a cat's body. And no, she wouldn't. And then I look back down at my phone and then all of a sudden I look up. She's closer, but she's not sitting up. She's like down on all four, like per, like a, like a pounce position. And she's stalking me. So my roommate was in the kitchen. I was like, come look at the cat. And we're looking at the cat, we're like, what the heck's wrong with her? What's she doing? Then she all of a sudden took off like a little jog on all four, like stalking position, and jumped into my lap, put her tail up in the air, started purring, pushed her head into my hand, all happy as can be, laid down on my lap. Why? <laughs> Why go through all that trouble, cat? You're like stalking me just to get attention. You didn't have to, I called to you. It was just weird. But she's all cute and adorable, so. She can get away with it. That's my cat story. It's a good one. <laughs> Other than that, I didn't do much. Put a serpentine belt on a truck. Um, seems like I'm the only one in this household that can do it. And don't take 10 years to do it. Uh, <laughs> Alright. Ooh. Is it really? That is one wider than this? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Reach! Can't reach. One more! Two more! One more. Nope. What? How many of them are there? How high did I go? I watch you! Yeah, I got it. What are you? It looks like a chest, but why are you glowing? Why are you a glowy chest? We must find out. Whee! What? Oh, oh, you're a blueprint thing. Hmm, what are you building with dark cane stone? Interesting. You have me intrigued. Pull! Uh, I made it. Yeah. Uh, this is almost right where I want to be. It actually is. Uh, yeah, let's just go up. Other than that, we spent all day yesterday, me and my roommate, trying to remember. Oh, I, I went too close. Uh, actually, I could just do this. Uh, trying to remember last year. For the life of us, neither one of us could remember last year. What we were doing, where we fishing. What was happening? Oh, I feel, saw something there. Okay. Like, what happened last year? We couldn't remember. It took us all day to piece together last year. It was just weird. And we tried to fix the TV. Which, we came really close to fixing the TV. Except for I'm losing my touch with electronics. I don't know what it is, but I am. I'm losing it. Because <laughs> uh, usually when I ignosin electronics, I don't make sparks, you know? I don't accidentally touch two leads together when testing electricity to see if it's going through the circuit board and blah, 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 blah. I did yesterday. <laughs> I made sparks twice. <laughs> and kind of melted some of the metal on the casing but didn't hurt any of the parts but we're thinking the TV is worth it to repair because it came from a bar right and bars usually don't cheap out on TVs and it's a Samsung we think it's a 62 inch at least that's what the part number says you measure it it says bigger but the part number says 62 inch plasma TV 
We're like, well, I mean, that's probably an expensive TV. So I looked it up. Plasma TVs that are going nowadays. 50 inch over a thousand bucks for a Samsung plasma TV. We're like, holy crap. And we got this TV for free. It didn't work. It doesn't turn on. <laughs> We're like, wow. Holy crap. Maybe this is worth looking, looking up to fix. And right now, we're looking at a hundred bucks to buy a new power supply circuit board for it, which isn't bad to fix a thousand dollar TV. But thing is, we all have TVs. <laughs> None of us needs a TV. So it's like, do we fix it? Is it worth fixing? I mean, yes, but also what's the point of fixing it when none of us needs a TV? Can I think I can make this little land thing? Ah, nope. Ow. Ah, we're, we're thinking about it. We're going to see. We're going to go to like uh, places around town that we know or around towns that we know that will do TV repair, but they usually do it for their clientele, not random people. You know, it's people who rent or buy TVs off of them. They're the ones that repair their TVs for them. We're going to see if they'll repair that circuit board. Or we can buy a replacement circuit board for someone who sold them a TV for a trade-in to a new TV. Stuff like that. If we can get uh, the circuit board for there for 50 bucks, then, you know, hey, that's worth it. That's my TV repair story. <laughs> I made it. Oh, I even made it with a little bit of lag there. We're doing great. We're making progress. Huh? Oh yeah, I even looked at the right moment. I can do this. <laughs> 500 snow. We're still doing good. Whoa. I don't know how we're shaping this. This is going to be difficult to shape, in my opinion. At least the note. Well, once we get one side done, it's going to be fairly easy. So I say. I think I just have to do a little bit of calculating. A little bit of numbers. And now I got to get down again. Whee! Ow. Now I got to do that side. Say what? I'll make this tube. Oh, hmm. Well, we're doing this in threes, right? It's three, 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 three. So it should be three in. If everything goes three in, leaves us with three on the nose. Should be a patch of three on the nose. And everything goes in. So this three, this this should be three deep solid. So I can sculpt it. Which I can do up there. Yeah, once I get this done, I'll be inside of the tunnel. And then I could make it three deep solid. And then we can sculpt it. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to finish this up. Go all the way. Up. Okay, my face cam's on. <laughs> I don't know why I just thought about it for a second. Yeah, I'm going to finish this line up. This bottom half, this bottom you thing and get that and probably get this three solid I think that will make that would work if not I could it's a start right oh look at the start I don't think I ever really looked up holy detailed although it's like a still picture isn't it yeah it definitely is a still picture you just paste it up there yeah, it's still pretty cool yeah I'll make that three deep solid over there, three deep solid. And then we'll sculpt the balloon. So, uh, give me one second. Actually, it's gonna happen for you right now. You all ready for the part that's probably gonna confuse the crap out of me? Because I sort of am, but I'm not. Okay, so. Uh, how am I doing this? It should be one, two, three three one two three 
one, two, a lot more than three. I still think that's probably the best bet to shape this is three on each side in. Nope, well, well, that's fine. I think. Yeah. This is not going to be party. All right, so all this gotta go. And then this gotta go. And that's gonna be our center. I gotta get up there. Right here. Uh -huh. Get off season. Oh, dang it all. I made this nice scaffolding so I wouldn't fall. Where am I? There I am. Uh, pull. Hit it. I made this nice scaffolding so I wouldn't fall, and I fall. Hit. Hit. All right. One, two, three. Cut the corner. Cut you all down. Cut the corner. Cut you all down. Bring me down. Back to my level. Good enough. Cut the corner. Y'all go down. And same here. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, I hope this works. I want you. I want you. I got you. That's the front. And then we go in one and down one, right? cut that corner because I think it's going to look weird without that corner cut. I never shaped that balloon before. I never. I don't know what I'm doing. I want it. Got it. Don't do that. Scared myself there. Corner in. And now skip one, go in. So I just gotta cut the ends in, that's it. Easy now. I'm unseed. I'm living dangerous. You think this is gonna look good? I might have to... Ooh. Ooh. Uh, maybe. This actually might look really good. It's all the corners cut, but what about this? Do I have a middle? One, two, three. Ah, ha, ha, ha. One, two, three. Ooh, 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 ooh. You have a middle. Oh, I have a, I have a three block, I should say. That might be it. Oh, I'm a genius. I've said it before, jokingly, but I'm saying it for the truth this time. Not really. Right, let's tear this down so we can look at it from a distance and see how cool it looks. Gimme. Gimme. Go faster. I thought like after the gauntlet recognizes you're picking up grass, it goes faster. Uh, uh, I uh, don't know which one my... Yes, I leaned my head to get a better view. Does that work? No. But did I do it? Yep. Alright. Uh oh, this way? <laughs> I'm like, there's no good view in platform. No perch. And turn. Whee! Yes. 
All right, let's go perch on this tree over here. Face time. Yeah. I mean, it does look like a balloon. Right? You know what it actually looks like? A bottle. <laughs> like a baby's bottle. <laughs> That's what it looks like right now. Hey, look, there's a leafy just hanging out chilling. It's like, yo, man, look at this thing. I'm up high. How do I get up here? I can't get down without dying. But you don't take fall damage. You jump. Anyway. It also looks weird with the two little pillars there, which aren't supposed to be there. They're just there because I need to get up. I don't think that's terrible. And I'm thinking of putting wings on the back. Or like obsidian. I think that's why I have these. Oh, actually, I can accent it, accent it in obsidian slabs. And maybe we should make a wing. It's like one wing here, one wing there, one wing there, one wing there. Not very hard, not very high. Like a three, a three, a high to a three angle, little L. Just there, just to help cut the wind. Then accent it, accent it in obsidian. Help. Give it a little bit more shape. That block that I put snow at the very tip. I almost said a different word to describe the end. <laughs> that <laughs> will be obsidian. <laughs> yeah. I think once we start doing that, that's going to take shape. But I need to shape the other side. And I want to take a look at it. I'm like, there. There's a pillar up there. And we'll take a look at it. Once I shaped the other side of the baby's bottle. And we're back. And it's shaped. The baby's bottle is now the same on both ends. And I think it looks pretty good. And like I said, once we have the back with the wings, the entire, like, I think I'm going to cut this middle. I know you can barely, you probably can't even see. Eh, you can, if you squint hard enough, you can see the dot. Cut the middle because it's three, so we have a middle. I'm learning to build an odds. And then we'll obsidian all the way there. Obsidian there. The obsidian is going to act like wire and like the. It will normally be inside the balloon. But we're going to have it on the outside of the balloon. So we have a little bit of detail on the balloon. And yeah, I think once it like wraps around, like kind of like the steel cage that is the infrastructure of the balloon to keep, to keep it its shape, to give it its shape. And then fins because I think they look cool. I lo I don't know how to make like a propulsion system. There's nothing here saying go. <laughs> I have a wheel to tell you to turn which means I need a rudder which will do absolutely nothing in the sky but I don't have a propulsion system. Although I will say the, the balloon is fueled by the mobs that spawn inside of it because it's hollow. <laughs> and not lit up. So the mobs that spawn inside of it fuel the balloon. But I don't know a propulsion system. I mean, we could probably put some rockets on the side. How cool would that be? Oh, but I don't have the industrial thing. Although, that would kind of... Would that be game breaking? Not game breaking. Would that be like... Build breaking if I put two rockets, a whole rocket here and the rocket on the other side. That'll be the propulsion. And then a rudder, actually, nah, I don't think a rudder would actually, a small little rudder in the back wouldn't really work, but I think we probably still will attempt to put a rudder there. How would we do a rudder? We don't have a, a slab corner piece, do we? No. You can't make a slab into a corner piece. I don't think you can. I'm not sure. I don't know. I'm not an expert. I'm an am I'm a professional amateur in training. I like it. I really do like the the boat. And it, it's it's yeah, but it's nice. I like it. And I think the nose has grown on me. Now that we have this going around there like that, the nose has grown on me. I think it's okay. You're a good nose. 
Bow strung. Bow strung. That's what it's called. Yeah, I think. That sounds right. I'm going to go with it until someone corrects me. But I really like the overall shape, and I think a couple rockets actually would be pretty funny. they got to be in there, Duster. I was about to check, but nah. Hey, look, we still got the pigs sitting in there. Haha, <laughs> you're trapped to never escape. Yeah, this is nice. Next episode, we will... This took longer than I thought. I'm looking down at the time. Next episode, we will detail the balloon and connect the balloon to the ship. In which I'm hoping wire will do it. This. I'm hoping this looks like wire. Although I can't really put it at an angle. If I put it at an angle, it's going to look weird. Because, you know, it's going to have the whole fence post thing. So I think it might just be connect. Connect. Like four connection points. Leave the middle open. Connect on all these four corners right here. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Connect to the balloon. Hopefully it connects into an obsidian point. I can make it connect to an obsidian point. Uh, I don't want to wrap the balloon the vertically. I don't want to really wrap the balloon vertically in obsidian, but we man, that might be too much. I think if we wrap it horizontally. Oh, it would be vertically on the front. Yeah, so I guess it would be. We might have to make the connection points here. On this middle row on the outside, which would be right there. On the stair, upside down stair. That will work. I'm okay with that. That gives that lip more of a purpose. Yeah. Yeah, I'm good with that. So that's how we'll connect our four, and that'll be pretty good. That'll just be a straight line. That will actually look like a wire. I'm okay with that. There's something I was going to look up. I was going to hit this and look at something. Come on, brain. Oh, ladders. Do we have... Uh, we, have we don't have, like, a rope ladder? Hang on, no. Search bar doesn't always tell you what you want to know. I have learned this. We gotta play with machines, too. Pyramid. Oh, checkpoint. Never mind. Not a pyramid. Oh, I wanna play with that, too. Snowball turret. Du -du 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 -du. Alright. Looking for ladders. Do we have, like, a rope ladder? That will look better than a wood ladder leading all the way up to the airship. I just hope we have one. Okay, there's a wood ladder. There's the stone ladder. I'm going to say no. It must have been a different game where I saw a rope ladder. Any premium ladders? Alright, so it's gonna have to be wood letters. I must have some wood letters left on me, right? Eleven. One, two, three. Well, actually, no. No, it's going from there to there. Yeah, okay, I have enough on me then to go from my little porthole thing here. My porthole? No, that's not it. A little gateway thing here. <laughs> All the way down. So we'll, we'll have to do that too. Or I'll probably. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. A little leafy, so terrified. You can't get that. Don't do it. You have so much to live for. Poor little leafy. He's just stuck over there. He's like one of those barnacle things that attach themselves to like whales and stuff to clean. What are those things called? Oh, the same thing on like the, they, they clean them. They clean like their belly and stuff like that and eat all the bacteria and not bacteria, whatever it is. He's like the little sucker fish of a fish tank. How about that? I know that. A little sucker fish of a fish tank. That's this little guy. He keeps our boat clean on the outside. He's a good boy. Or girl. Eh. But that's going to do it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. We got to light that place up. We'll put lights. We haven't even worked on lights yet. I was thinking of lighting up the top. But I'm not. Still might. We might put, might put some lanterns or something up there. Some like wood lanterns. Although it's going to be obsidian. So maybe Arctic 
lights, whatever they're called, that I've been, I used a crap ton in the castle. Who knows, I had to go back to my place anyway and grab obsidian blocks, because I don't have blocks on me, I have slabs on me, but I'm going to need some blocks. But like I'm saying, that's going to do it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. 33 degrees? That's like outside right now. Uh, I pillared this way. Hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, hit that thumbs up button and show your support. If you're new and you haven't, subscribe for more content. Feel free to share this video and comment down below. And until next time, I'm Apex Reaper. You all stay positive. Thanks for watching. Afraid of the dark? Are you scared?